was a little bit of a but uh, it was time. All right. So the topic of of this conference is agents of change. So basically, it's uh, from my understanding, it's it's actually people who are able to impact their communities positively, bring change, hopefully positive change, to make things better for others. And uh, there are actually about like there's so many ways to go about doing that. You know, you can you, you could do it through politics, you could do it through entertainment as a star, because you have so much influence on others, etc. I'm an entrepreneur, so I try to do it my way, the entrepreneur way. So uh, I'm uh, I'm very fond of my country. I love Morocco. I would, want, I, would, I would like to see Morocco as... So, I would, like to see, I would like to see Morocco as one of the developed countries out there that, that, that... It is going to take a while, we're not going as fast as we need to, but, but it's getting there, which is a good thing. So, since I was a kid, I left Morocco when I was 11 and moved to the U.S. I had the opportunity to, to do my, to have my uh, engineering degree there and also work there. And I never felt home in the U.S. You know, even though I'm there, I have a lot of friends, etc. I have family there as well. I never felt that it feels like home, you know. You're always the guy who migrated from a different country to the U.S. And for that reason, I've always wanted to make Morocco an amazing place where I could live. Because I've tried many times to come to Morocco, I came here, I spent a few months, a year maybe two, and then I packed up my stuff and left. I was like, I'm screwed this. <laughs> I can't deal with this country. <laughs> it's crazy. <laughs> So, so, so while I was, um, after I launched a few startups, some of them were a complete catastrophe, some of them were a complete success. I have four offices in four different countries, Marrakesh, San Francisco, Kuala Lumpur and Hong Kong. So we have offices in four places with employees and the whole nine yards. And um, the thing is, all the technology that Linkery has built, everything we have done, everything that, that, that gives Linkery the value it has right now was built by Moroccans from Asfi, from Marrakesh, from Ezzedida we have people in our office in Marrakesh that are all over Morocco and it's pretty amazing, it's pretty amazing because we took a company, an idea, it's not even, it was like just a crazy idea and we worked really hard on it, we pivoted every time we realized something is wrong we just changed strategies very quickly before we run out of money, and um, and I was actually able to get investors from Morocco. We got the first investment, about a hundred thousand dollars, from a French investor who's already invested in a few of my previous startups. And then people were complaining; they were like, "Ah, he's French. That's why he invested so much money. That's so high valuation." So I love these kind of challenges. so important and just just give it time and think about it it, it is it is really not about what can people do for you you know stop crying stop complaining you know just nobody wants to hear your problems everybody has problems so just make it happen when you make it happen then people start listening to you you know if I made my first startup and it didn't work second one didn't work if I didn't do anything I wouldn't be here you know, so when you actually, against all odds, you make it happen, people start listening.